Okay, so today I'm gonna be talking to you guys about rumors. Right now, rumors hurt, and it bothers me. I don't see how you can be mean enough to say something about somebody else knowing that it's gonna hurt them and their reputation and still do it. I don't understand it. It makes no sense to me. I think I'm a nice person. Like, there are times if you get on my nerves or if you say something about me that I don't like or if you bully somebody in front of me or if I hear about something, I'm gonna stand up for them. I'm gonna say something to you. I try to stop bullying. I try to stop people from doing things that hurt others. And I think that that should be okay. I don't think that that makes me a bad person. I don't think that makes me mean. I'm not saying I've never spread a rumor because I, I have before, but I tried as hard as I could from sixth grade on not to because I realized how much it hurts. So you think that people would understand that, but no, everyone wants to be cool. So they do what they want to do and they say what they want to say and they make up all the stuff and then she's a slut and she's a whore and she, all she did was put a bow in her hair. Like, all she did was wear a dress to school. I don't understand it. Like, I am a 14-year-old girl, and I understand how much it hurts to wear a dress to school one day just because you feel like wearing a dress, and you get called a slut. Like, I... Why can't everyone just be nice to each other? I don't even know. It's... I think it's horrible what has started to happen in this world and that people are ending their lives because of this. People are hurting themselves because of this. Like, I just don't think that it's okay to get out of it, to get away from it, to get away from all the ridiculousness that is going on on this planet. That's what's happening now. Because Fred Flintstone over there can't keep his mouth shut about Sally Sue because she used a packer blanket and that makes her a horrible human being so you have to tell her and everyone else all these lies about her that aren't true especially like if she doesn't know who started it but none of it's true but she doesn't know who started any of it and i think that sucks you know it still sucks to have a rumor spread about you but it's a lot easier to deal with when you know who started it because then you can go and say hey bob why'd you say this Instead of being, because then you have to go through everyone else that's talking about it, see who they heard it from, and then of course they're not gonna tell you because they don't want to be a snitch. Then it goes from person to person to person to person. It just bothers. Me. Like I mean, I I get the concept of, well, they have to be mean to other people because they have a bad home life. But if that's how you're treated at home, you should realize that that's not what you should be doing. If you don't like the way you're treated at home, don't treat other people like that in school or anywhere like if i had a sucky home life and i was getting picked on every single night when i got home i wouldn't go to school and do that like you're not gonna go to school and be like you know what my dad beats me up at night so i'm gonna punch you in the face and break your nose because of my problems i don't understand the mental the mentality of this i don't get it but it bothers me i just think that the world should realize that being nice really helps give for no reason i should be able to give someone a brownie without them being like what do you want from me? It should just be like, I just want to give you a brownie. I'm just a nice person. I just want to give you a brownie. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I don't know.